Hello and welcome to Vision Academy. My name is Hanuman Ladwa and in this video we are going to write a C++ program to find the area and circumference of a circle. Let us write the preprocessor directives hash include in angular base we are going to write iostream.h header file and the next preprocessor directive is hash include and in angular base we are going to write console input output dot h header file and next we are going to write wide main function and curly open brace and here in a declaration section we have to declare all the variables so before we declare all the variables let us understand how to calculate area and circumference of the circle so mathematically speaking so the area of the circle can be determined by the formula pi r square and now the circumference of the circle can be determined by the formula circumference is equal to 2 pi r so here pi is constant that is 22 divided by 7 so which is approximately 3.142 then we are going to replace this pi value with this constant value so r is the radius of the circle that we are going to receive from the user now let us write the variables uh, of type float here I'm going to write floating type of data that is real number uh, type of data and then I'm going to write the variable called radius and then area and I'll take one more variable called circumference and then put semicolon now I'm going to write CLR SCR function which is used to clear the screen now we'll ask the user to enter the radius using cout stream insertion operator in a double quotation mark I'm going to write enter the radius so end the double quotation mark and put semicolon and we are going to receive the input from the user through keyboard using scene stream extraction operator and then i'm going to take the variable name radius and put semicolon so after receiving the radius i need to calculate area using the formula pi r square so now i'm going to write the variable area is equal to and then i'm going to write pi r square pi can be written as 3.142 here i'm going to write 3.142 and r square can be written as radius into radius so here uh, into can be written as asterisk symbol and then i'm going to write radius asterisk symbol and radius and put semicolon and after that i need to calculate circumference of the circle whose formula is 2 pi r now i'm going to use this variable circumference i'm going to write here circumference is equal to that is 2 is constant pi is constant here i'm going to write 2 asterisk symbol pi is 3.142 into r is radius so i'm going to write the variable name as radius now whatever the value for radius is entered by the user it will be calculated using this formula and the value will be stored in area in the same way in order to calculate the circumference of the circle it is going to receive the input from the user for this variable radius and it is going to calculate with these two constants and value will be stored in circumference of, of the circle right yes next we are going to print uh, using cout statement stream insertion operator in a double quotation mark i'm going to write area of circle is equal to end the double quotation mark stream insertion operator then the value stored in area here i'm going to write the name of the variable called area and then stream insertion operator endl that brings the cursor down to the next line once again i'm going to write one more statement to print the circumference of the circle see out stream insertion operator in a double quotation mark i'm going to write circumference of the circle is equal to end the double quotation mark stream insertion operator and the value stored in a variable called circumference here i'm going to write circumference and then put semicolon and here i'm going to write get ch function then put curly closing brace for this main function now let us take an example here i'm going to write output 
when we compile and run this program it will ask the user to enter the radius next i'm going to enter 5 for example so this 5 will be stored in a variable called radius so just because of this particular statement so after receiving the value for this variable radius we have to calculate area so how to calculate area area can be calculated using formula pi r square so pi value is 3.142 into radius is 5 so here i'm going to write 5 into again radius that is 5 so further you can simplify this 5 5 is 25 25 into 3.142 so here i'm going to write 3.142 into 25 so 5 2 is 10 carry 1 and 0 2 4 is 20 plus 1 is 21 2 is carry 1 next 2 5 1 is 5 plus 2 is 7 5 3 is 15 next plus 2 2 is 4 2 4 is 8 2 1 is 2 2 3 is 6 next add 0 this is 5 this is 15 and here 5 plus 3 is 8 and this is 7 so after the uh, decimal points we have got three digits so after the decimal point three digit means here one two three then you can put uh, decimal point here that is 78.550 so here the value of area is 78.55 now let us calculate circumference here i'm going to write circumference is equal to 2 into pi is 3.142 into r is what r is radius 5 so i'm going to write here 5 so now let us calculate here you can write 2 5 is 10 10 into 3.142 so when we multiply 10 into 3.142 you just shift this decimal point from left to right so it will become 31.4 and after this so this value will be stored in the variable called circumference and after this we have got see out statement so it is going to print area of circle area of circle is equal to will be printed as it is and the variable is holding the value that is 78.55 similarly just because of this backward slash n or endl so cursor will come down to the next line and it is going to print circumference of the circle circumference of the circle is equal to will be printed as it is and here we have written the variable name called circumference and circumference is holding value 31.42 so let us execute this program for that i will take you to my laptop screen here you can see I have already written this program in Turbo C++ compiler to save your time. Let us compile this program by pressing Alt F9. Here it is showing success that indicates there is no syntax error. Now I am going to press enter and now let us run this program by pressing Ctrl F9. Here it is asking the user to enter the radius. For example, I am going to enter 5 and then press enter. Here you can see it is printing area of circle is equal to 78.55. And the circumference of circle is equal to 31.42. I hope you understood this program. If so, please write down in the comment box as understood. Thank you.